Chaos V20 tokens are just around the corner and there are different Casper wallets that you can use. And in today's video, I'm going to show you which wallet will support the new Chaos V20 tokens and how to set it up. Let's go. First of all, still apologize my bad video quality. I'm still on vacation, but let's go with the tutorial. If we check out Casper's FAQ for Casplex, which is a protocol that supports the KRC20 tokens, we can scroll down a little bit and under the wallet section we can see how will KRC20 tokens uh, be stored within a user's wallet and the answer is there is no need for additional support from the wallet. Users can query their KRC20 balance via Casplex APIs and wallet developers can also integrate in our APIs to deploy their own indexer or to display KRC20 assets in their wallet. So KRC20 tokens is a protocol made by Casplex and they provide an API that other wallet developers from other wallets can use in order to display the KRC20 tokens. But so far I've only found one Casper wallet which has actively confirmed that they are going to display the KRC20 tokens. And if we check out the Casper wallet, we can see that they didn't confirm it. If we check out the Caspium wallet, we can see that they also didn't confirm it yet. But there's a wallet Casware. And if we check out their Twitter channel, we can see that they tweeted like a week ago or a little bit over a week ago that Casware's wallet support for KRC20 will be launched soon. Follow us and stay tuned. Since they launched it on June 4, I can imagine that they are already working on how to integrate the KRC20 tokens since they are getting the APIs from Casplex. So they will be definitely one of the first wallets, if not the first wallet, uh, which is integrating KRC20 tokens. So you should get familiar with this wallet already so that you can be one of the very first investors to invest in different meme coins on KRC20, which can be a huge potential if we look at base meme coins, just as Brad, for example. So if we check out Casper Wallet, we can uh, follow the link here in, uh, on Twitter. So just look for their Twitter uh, channel, which is Casper Online Wallet. And then you can find the real website here, casper.xyz. And then you can find the wallet as well. So that you follow the correct links and not get like on a scam link or something. Just follow the Twitter channel and then you can find the correct link here. And if we check out their website, we can see that they offer uh, a download link via Gitbook or or the Gitbook or a Google Chrome symbol because this wallet is only available as a Google Chrome extension. So I'm using Firefox right now, but I've also installed Google Chrome on my Mac. So you have to get Chrome first and then you can use the um, Casper wallet. So switch to Chrome, yes. And if we switch to Chrome here, one second here, I've already opened up the website then we can download the wallet here. We are going to do it together now. So I'm doing it for the very first time. My laptop is in German, so it will say Entsufing, which means add. So I can add this extension now, and then it should be displayed here on the top, correct. So now we wanna keep it in English. Let's see, where is it? Here. And now I can click create a new wallet since I don't have a wallet already. So I click on create a new wallet. I can set up a password, which will we set as Casper1234, just for the tutorial. Casper1234, continue. And now they show us the seed phrase. We can choose between a 12 word seed phrase or a 24 word seed phrase. If you're going to use it on your personal computer, I would recommend a 24 word seed phrase because it's just like more secure. But in this video, I'm going to go with a 12 word seed phrase and also take a paper and a pin and then write it down. Do not screenshot it. Do not write it on a, like a text note on your computer. Do not take a photo with your, um, with your uh, phone or something because there are spyware out there like a uh, virus and uh, spyware and malware and they will search your phone or your computer with algorithms for like uh, pictures that look like 12 words or they will actually look for like this kind of patterns on your computer. So just write it down here on a uh, paper. I will do that now with a quick and then we will be back. Okay, I've written them all down so I can click on I save my seed phrase, continue. Now it gives me the address type, which is here the default. I can have a passphrase here for this address if I want to secure this address again. So I'm using now, let's say, tutorial 
one, two, three, four. And that's it. So now I've um, set up my Casware wallet for the very first time. So I have a balance of zero. So I can click on receive now to get my address and then I can uh, send some cash from my other wallets or from an exchange, for example, that uh, like Gate.io, for example, or MXE to this address, and then I can use it for my KFC20 tokens. Same with the uh, send button. As soon as you have the uh, assets here, you can use the send button. It just works like MetaMask, so there shouldn't be any issues with that. And we can also check out the settings over here. So we can check, uh, save some contacts. We have the connected sites. I would recommend to you, since it's just working like MetaMask, if you connect to a website like a meme coin in the future, after you have done whatever you want to do, go to the connected sites and disconnect. Just make sure that you always disconnect from websites that you don't actively use, so that you're never connected to any website because if they get hacked, maybe it can have some influence on your wallet. It shouldn't be, but we are with crypto. Better be safe than sorry. So yeah, just uh, like check your connected sites and then the network and stuff like that is what we are probably going to use later on if, if there are more developments on the Casper network. But for now, that's everything we need to know. Uh, everything we need to know. If you have any questions regarding KFC20 wallets, write them down below in the comments and I will be very happy to answer them. And in our next video, we are going to check out promising projects on KFC20 or on the Casper chain for KFC20 pro uh, protocols. So check out my next video, which will come out on Sunday probably. See ya. Bye bye.